open in the morning, but we've pretty much been up since five. I slept. You slept? I no, I I mean I sleep. Well, right? I slept. Yeah, I slept. Yeah. So we went down a little past midnight, maybe like 12:20, but then the kids woke up at four, and then I tried to put them down. Jet lagged. For show. What are you drawing? What is that? A crazy forest. A forest? Cool. Good morning again. It's 11.20 and everyone's still asleep. I think Benji may be sleeping in the girls' bedroom. The twins. Gotta make that rice. Oh, great. This is so nasty. This is like one month old rice. Wait a minute. Wait, hold on. Is Beyonce having twins? Twins? <laughs> Our family will be growing by two. Oh, man, really? <laughs> I got some news. Got Beyonce. Oh man, you already knew. Actually, you're right. Twins got Beyonce. Now she's everything. <laughs> This is the collaboration that we did with Pixie. I love it. This is the best packaging ever. So there's Aspen. She's so sweet. I met her a few months ago in New York. And she came out with highlighters and this duo with a lower lash mascara and a brow tamer. Miriam, I also met her in New York. A beauty inside and out. And she's like, it's so cool. We're into the same music. And her husband's so sweet too. And she came out with cheek palettes, highlight and contour. And this is a bronze and contour palette. And then Carolyn Herons, amazing esthetician. We've only met twice, but she is hilarious. I feel like I could talk to her forever. So she came out with a cleanser. So you guys can purchase all of these at your local Target or pixiebeauty.com. And check out this cute phone from Benefit. Yeah, yeah, trying this coffee from the Philippines in the AeroPress today. I went to do pour over coffee, and unfortunately, no filters. So, um, bought on Amazon, amazing. They didn't have overnight shipping, but they did have two day shipping, so all have that in a couple days. But AeroPress, one of my favorite ways to make coffee because it's just so easy. Anyways, and then you just take this off again, be very careful. And when you pop this out, boom, you got the grounds. Super easy. Very strong, very delicious. Thank you. It's 2.30. Daddy opened my door. Oh, Daddy opened the door? Yeah. Good daddy, afternoon. I saw Daddy singing. Uh-huh. You mean you heard Daddy singing? Wait. <laughs> I think Mia's still sleepy. Auntie Mel Mel. Oh, that's not Auntie Mel Mel. It looks like Auntie Mel Mel. Wait out. Her name is Miriam. You guys want to see something really awesome? What? Look, this lip is a phone. Yeah, Daddy told me it, it was. Come here. Come here. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> not like that. You just yeah. use one side. Huh? You had a nightmare? I didn't remember leave me. It's 2.30 in the afternoon. No. It's It's... Are you excited to have this with milk and get to drink your milk afterwards? Let's 
she is gonna want to eat that. Mm -hmm. You gotta drink all your milk like a big girl, though. Whoa, good job, Kira. Kira's hungry. It's kind of sad leaving a tropical place and like fruits just cannot even compare. Like, at least we have good apples here. That's like the blessing yeah. of Washington. We have the best Yee. apples. I'm gonna try something new. I'm gonna try to unpack everything today. I know. I know. I never unpack this early. I just don't want this sitting around for months like they usually do. The kids are playing school. What kind of dog? What? No, what kind? The Dalmatian dog. Dalmatian dog. Go back to school. Come on. We're going to read the down. No, go in me. Now, me. What? What? Which dog is this? Uh, Dalmatian. Yeah. Dalmatian. So, what kind of Dalmatian book is this? You are the special helper, so you get to read. these bags for Juliana's teachers and I was gonna put some goodies in here and I totally just broke the zipper like it just broke off there's no way in fixing it cuz thing is like completely broken it'll just have to be an open tote that's what I get for not investing in a better quality bag this was I think 200 pesos so it was like four dollars I'm almost done unpacking this is the last luggage and we're all set Oh, okay. Wow, well, look at my big girl. Anyway, so I'm almost done. And how are you doing? Look at that face. <laughs> you need to get those boxes out of the garage. And we need to unpack that because there are perishable items in there. All the knacks, aka snacks, from the Philippines. We need to unpack that, huh? So it doesn't go bad. You're done? Okay, I'll be right there. So you know me, I'm not into politics and sometimes I don't know what's going on in the world. But I have been seeing stuff about this, what is it, a ban? What's going on, honey? A ban on refugees from Coming Muslim into specific countries. This is where the ISIS have come from. But then, is he not targeting Muslims? Well, or, that's the question here. How much of this is media hype versus how much of it is... I don't know, but like from what I'm seeing from the media, exactly. it's ridiculous. I mean, who knows? You're right. Like, how the do you really is, know The media is saying on? it one way when the other side is saying it another way. Muslims feel like they're being targeted mm -hmm. because they're all Muslim countries or like where there's a, a huge population of Muslims, but they are targeting extremists from the Muslim religion. And that is where the argument is. I don't know. I don't know what's going on, but when it involves like US citizens not able to come into the state, that's a little disturbing. Okay, so now there's a fire at UC Berkeley. It's just sad everything that's happening in this world. Careful, Kira! <laughs> Someone's gonna get hurt. I just know it. Go! 
I felt. Get on! Wait, wait, wait. 2.24 in the morning! Yeah, the kids are awake and I'm awake. We went down at around 9.30. Woke up around 1.30. Luckily, they're staying in their room, but they're like straight up plain. <laughs> I'm just trying to finish this vlog before I call them downstairs. Even if they wake up at 12, still better than 2. So anyway, I'm just going to quickly finish this vlog. And I'm going to call it a night here. Benji actually just knocked out because he stayed up. So jet lag at its finest. And we will see you guys tomorrow. Night night. Or shall I say good morning? Like a little audio over that, honey, to make me sound good. All right. Anyways.